Okay, so I'm at the pond here now along the snowshoe trail. Yeah. <clears throat> this is where the trail goes down this hill and across part of the pond there. <clears throat> yeah, things are starting to soften up a bit now and I wouldn't cross that anyways. It's not that deep there, but um, it would be a pain if I went through the ice on my snowshoes and it would be hard to pull them back out again, I'm sure. Anyways, this is where I'm going to turn around and head back. But it's farther than I expected to go, really. <clears throat> so I'm quite content. That's the way I came in here now. I hear the crows making a lot of noise up there. Yeah. Very quiet. Besides the crows. But I like that sound. I am getting a bit warm now. <laughs> Sweating. <clears throat> That's why I don't really want to go farther now because I know if I go all the way around it's going to get too hot. <clears throat> so I enjoyed it anyway so it was really nice. I think uh, it's supposed to be sunny all day today and then uh, tomorrow I think we're going to get some cloudy uh, cloudy weather. I think we're going to get a little bit of snow this week too. Yeah, not a lot but uh, it'll probably be wet snow and it'll probably melt pretty fast too. So it's that time of year you know. But I, the, what I'm, from what I'm seeing, although I never believe the weather forecast, um, <clears throat> the temperatures are starting to get a little bit uh, milder now. So we're going to start seeing some melting now. But it's going to take a lot of melting, boy, to get rid of all this snow. And uh, when that water, when that snow melts, it's going to be a lot of water, high water levels. But in, here in Elliott Lake, it really doesn't affect us that much because. Elliott Lake itself is is built on a high uh, spot, so <clears throat> you know there's not really any flooding in town or anything like that. Anyways, let's head back. <clears throat> 